Hello guys. Today I'll show you how you can how you can install the I'm gonna show you how you install JPEXX to point also known as a flash file editor. So all you gotta do is you're gonna visit this link. You're gonna visit it right here. You're gonna visit that. And then what you're gonna do is on your Chromebook, if you on your Chromebook, you're gonna click on this. But if you want to install this, you have to go to your settings, go to the Developers tab, and click on Turn on on the Linux development environment. You go click Turn on right here. But for me, because I just want to turn on, it'll just take me straight into the settings. After you turn it on, what you're going to do is you're going to click on this button and what that will do is it will install a Flash JPX decolorizer, also known as the SWF file editor. So yep, you're going to click on the file and then what you're going to do is you're going to click this drop down, open. And you're gonna click install Linux. And what that will do is it will show the application details. Next, what you're gonna do is you're gonna click install. And that will install the application for you. As you can see, it installed quickly because. I already have the application installed. I already have this app installed. And then what you're going to do is you're going to go over to the launcher and head over to your Windows X tab and then you're going to click on this app right here, JPX3 Flash Deployer. Like, you have this app file in there. You click on the application and boom. You have an SWF file editor, the flash file editor on your Chromebook. <coughs> As you can see, I already have. As you can see. And there you go. This is the home page where you open it the first time. As you can see, this is my recent files. It's not going to show because you have not uploaded any new files. So yeah, you won't be able to you know, show this off. Like, you won't be able to use any of the recent files because this is a private application. There you go, guys. That's how you install. The GPX Flash Deployer on your Chromebook. I have a link to this in the description. If you, if I do, if you do not know what I am talking about, and the version you're going to install is version fourteen point four point zero. You're going to install this one, and this may not be stable, but if it's not stable, you can install. This section over here, like you can install this this version over here, like this one. But this one's a pre-release. But you're gonna install version fourteen point four point zero if you want the not if you want the stable version. And this is the OS system. Yeah. This is me signing off.